Welcome to Lantaria's new product support site. Our help center now contains our standard product manual, setup and configuration guides, how-to videos, release notes, FAQs, knowledge base articles, and much more. Let's take a quick look at the site to see all that it offers. Our new help site has a brand new interface featuring a search bar predominantly located in the center of the screen for quick use. There are also two tiers below that that provide access to all of our online content. Let's take a closer look at those two tiers now. In the first tier, there are three sections, quick user guide, video tutorials, and release notes. Each of these contain custom curated information to help clients quickly get up and working in the system. By selecting the quick user guide, you will be taken to a concise product manual that has details for site configuration and administration. In the left hand column, you'll see that information and you can reveal additional details by clicking the caret symbol next to each subtopic. You can use the filter option located at the top of the outline to refine the topics shown. Simply begin typing the initial letters of your word or phrase and the system will refine and reduce the number of entries that are specific to what you were searching for. Click the X to remove the filter. The central search bar lets clients type in a word or phrase to search the site contents. Initially, the system will open a small window and return top links for the requested phrase. You can also click on the advanced search, which will take you to all of the results for that particular topic. Since a large number of items are returned, you can also use the category and the tags features to filter out and reduce the number of results. In this case, if we were to click Employee Self-Service and then Apply, you'll see that the number is reduced greatly. The system will highlight the phrase in yellow throughout the links. You can click on the X to remove the search phrase and also you can click on Clear to reduce any of the filters that are being used. The other two sections on the first tier, Video Tutorials and Release Notes, each open in a separate browser window. Video Tutorials takes you to Lantaria's YouTube page, where there are a number of quick how-to videos that you can watch. The majority of the videos are less than 10 minutes, so it's a quick and easy visual reference for learning how to do something new. Release Notes will let you see what is the most current changes and updates that have been made to our code. This will take you to the home page of our company website under our resources section where again you can see detailed information about updates by module. Scrolling further down the screen you'll see the second tier which is browse by category. There are three sections here HR, manager self-service and employee self-service. Each of these categories directs to topics that are specific to that permission role within the system. Clicking on the HR category reveals a list of each module offered in our product suite. You will see a list of articles underneath each topic and when you drill further down additional subfolders will be shown. You can continue to reveal more information for as many tiers provided. The Manager Self-Service section lists topics specific to this role and in helping with my team tasks and activities such as get an overview of your entire team or manage team absences. And finally, the Employee Self-Service easily becomes a quick reference for new and existing employees who want to learn how to navigate and utilize the features of the system, such as creating a help desk request, updating their personal details, or submitting a vacation request. 
Our home page also includes recently created articles, which details new features within our product suite, most read articles, and most viewed articles based on our client's popularity. The last item to note is located here at the bottom of our screen, which is the feedback portal. The link to our feedback portal is available for clients to add their suggestions for improvements to our core application. Clicking the Suggest Improvement button will let you provide details and then others will be able to vote on each suggestion. The items with the highest number of votes are considered for our annual roadmap. Thanks for watching our video on our new product support site. Check back once in a while to see any of the new features or information that will be added as we continue to expand this new site.